Huawei has just shared some big news that could change the tech landscape in China. The company informed Chinese President Xi Jinping that the country's chip shortage situation is improving, bringing a sense of relief amid ongoing concerns about U.S. restrictions. A recent report reveals that President Hassan met with several private sector executives to discuss the challenges China's tech industry has been facing due to U.S. sanctions. These restrictions have made it difficult for Chinese companies to access advanced semiconductor technologies, causing a major setback in the country's tech growth. However, Huawei's latest statement suggests that the situation is gradually getting better. Ren Zhengfei, the founder of Huawei, attended the meeting with President Tase and provided an update on China's semiconductor and operating system development. He stated that the long-standing issue of self-reliance in these areas is now easing, indicating that China is making significant progress. This information comes from the People's Daily, a well-known Chinese media outlet. It reported that several major companies, including BYD and Xiaomi, participated in the discussion with the Chinese president. In total, six company founders were given the opportunity to speak and representatives from firms like DeepSeek and Alibaba were also present. During the meeting, Red and Zheng Fi confidently stated that China's concerns over the so-called lack of core and soul in its tech industry have eased. He expressed strong optimism about China's future in technology, saying, I firmly believe a greater China will rise faster. To put things into perspective, a Chinese technology minister explained that the term core refers to semiconductors, while Seoul represents operating systems. Over the past few years, China has struggled in both these areas due to trade tensions with the U.S. But now, Huawei believes that the situation is turning around for the better. The U.S.-China tech war has been ongoing for years. It all started back in 2019 when the U.S. government imposed strict sanctions on Huawei, preventing it from accessing advanced chip-making tools and technologies. As a result, the company faced a severe semiconductor shortage, impacting its smartphone production and overall business. On top of that, U.S. authorities banned Google from providing Huawei with Google Mobile services, making it difficult for the company to compete in the global smartphone market. However, Huawei didn't back down. Instead of relying on foreign technologies, the company partnered with local firms and worked towards self-sufficiency. Over the years, Huawei has successfully developed its own Kirin 5G chips and introduced the Harmony OS Next operating system as a replacement for Google software. Now, the company is confident that both its semiconductor and OS situations are improving day by day. Chinese tech firms are moving forward with determination. The company's latest statement suggests that China's goal of technological self-reliance is no longer just a dream. It's becoming a reality. If the current momentum continues, China could soon emerge as a major player in the global semiconductor and software industry. That's all for now. Let us know your thoughts in the comments. Do you think China will overcome the chip shortage completely? And how do you think the US will react to these developments? Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on the latest tech news. See you in the next video.